All right, so now how to test the bars. These are the neat bars, you can see, they're all here. We got them cleaned up pretty decently. Uh, Ta-da. And so what they do, you uh, measure them, you input them in the parameters on the machine, you set it all up. This is the machine. All right, and we've already uploaded the parameters. So then what we do, so we just go, it's, it's all done, everything. And the machine will start pulling it apart. And show this data right here. And you'll see the curve. Grow, grow, and grow, and grow. Do, 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 do. How's it going? Ah, pretty good. Doing a video on how this stuff works. And then you'll watch it go down, and it'll probably, it's elastomeric. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, the material isn't necessarily an elastomer, but it will stretch out. And you'll gotcha. get this long curve. It goes back down, and it'll keep going. Let's see. You can see it's actually spreading apart. Right now, we're at uh, 2.6 millimeters of distance that it's pulled apart so far ah, and it, the there it goes it went down to 50 percent failure strain so there you go and you can see here's the data modulus elasticity megapascal and then the maximum load 63.85 uh, really what you're looking at is the maximum stress because that's when it fails that's when it it doesn't do its job anymore uh, if you're talking about a part or something like that Ta-da! And it's that simple.